We present an automatic approach to synthesize poses for virtual characters according to the user's pose, thus obtaining a realistic and vivid photo. Most people like taking photos with iconic characters in different scenes, such as taking a fantastic photo with Mickey Mouse. A recent trend is to use virtual characters in a live photo. However, the virtual characters in such applications are with fixed poses without considering any interaction with the user. And designing poses manually is tedious and challenging in practice. In this paper, we propose a novel optimization-based approach consisting of two stages. In the learning stage. The collected datasets are pre-processed to extract the pose feature vectors, which are fed into the fully connected networks. The two trained classifiers are used to evaluate the aesthetic level of one pose. In the optimization stage. The optimizer modifies the virtual character's pose and evaluates the corresponding results iteratively, such that it matches the posed user. An MCMC sampler is used to explore the solution space. We design two strategies to propose a move. Correlation move. If the sampler takes a correlation move, the correlated joint of the selected joint is sampled together. For example, the rotation of the shoulder will drive the elbow up and down. The same for the hip joint and knee. So these two set of correlated joints will be sampled together. Prior move. If the sampler takes a prior move, the joint is selected according to the probability of its change to the natural standing pose. Since when a person presents a pose to take an appealing photo, the joints he adjusts often concentrate in a subset. For example, the elbow will be selected with a high probability based on the T pose. This is an example of pose optimization from the initialized T pose. As the optimization process proceeds, the pose of the virtual character is iteratively updated until the two poses converge to the desired visual aesthetic expression. The optimization finishes in about 250 milliseconds. Here are some photographs with costumed virtual characters. Showing different scenes and different presented users. To verify our proposed approach, we compare two baseline approaches of virtual character pose synthesis. That is, random synthesis, and professional synthesis. In quantitative experiments, we analyze the pose aesthetic expression and synthesis time. Among the three compared approaches, our approach attained advantages in both performances. In qualitative experiments, we recruited 42 participants to rate the results in two parts, pose evaluation and overall evaluation. In all cases, our syntheses are more preferable than random syntheses and are comparable to professional syntheses. Please refer to our paper for more details. Thank you.